Hello everyone, I am so happy to see you. According to YouTube analytics, over 70% of you guys are not subscribed to the channel. If you guys want Pugsley to eat this month, I suggest you do so. Enjoy the video guys, I love you guys forever and always. Okay, I'ma try Bork. I haven't built this iron forever. Oh no, I haven't built it in forever, I just wanna build it. I'm not leashing. <laughs> bro, I don't wanna get a disadvantage just to help you, bro. Sorry. Bro, it's just so annoying, honestly. But you don't get to touch the wave first, and it's just... Have to play safe, it's just like... Why, bro? I don't want to. Can I get my PTA here 100%? Yep. Oh my god, that just did half his HP. Bro, PTA just did half his HP. Three autos. Dang, we do damage. That's why I'm trying to get used to something else. Honestly, just in case I have to. I think I killed this guy. It's fine. Man, 2v1. Dang, I didn't get my animation cancelled. It's fine, bro. Dang, two booms. Still a third of his HP. Okay, I'll just buy damage. It's fine, bro. I don't mind. Buy lifesteal. Lifesteal is huge. Bro, this guy's playing so safe. I autoed him three times in the beginning. He hasn't stepped up since. Him out, I guess, bro. Yep, there we go. He finally fights me. Oh my god, bro. He's just playing so safe the entire time. Finally. I finally got him, bro. He only went in when I let him hit ability on me. I literally had to let him, like, either walk up, hit, let him hit a Q. Okay, pickaxe, boots. We chillin'. The thing, it isn't even a bad matchup for him, he just... He's just not playing him correctly, he's not playing Jace correctly, he isn't trying to poke me or anything. Cause he had more range than me early. He just had to watch out not to get one shot on Neganar. I, <laughs> I don't know what he's doing. I can, I can dive this guy once I get Ignite Mega easily, I just have to push it. Okay, two plates, we'll take that. Okay, ETP, that's fine. I still poke a ton under tower with my ult. Good Q. Just hit the tower a little bit. Try to Q again, perfect. Half HP already. I can uh, poke under tower, I think, maybe. Uh, I have to clear the wave quickly though, so let me just try to do that. Uh, yeah, I think I can poke a little bit. I actually kill. There we go. And, and and he loses a wave under tower, so it's worth. Let's go. Okay, I've got Bork now. Bork is gonna be broken. I think if you're ahead, Bork is actually really broken one on one. Team fights, eh? But one on one, I think it's one of the best items on Nar. Good thing about Jace, he doesn't build any HP or anything. So if you hit like a boomerang or two, you can just dive him. Flash towards me at least. I can get this lead. Nice. Oh, my backwards Q hit him. <laughs> yep. This game is over. That was like the perfect throw. Him. We got so many kills. It's six to one. We winning. Another good thing about Bork is that we just get lifesteal and we don't have to have a worry in the world. Kind of like a Warmog's play style, but you just hit the minions to get the uh, HP back. And then, yeah, we got three plates. Perfect, bro. Hey, and I even got four plates. Let's go, baby. He has his first item, too. Eclipse is so cheap. But I get plus 30 per auto, so... Honestly, bro, it might not matter. Yeah, lifesteal is one of my favorite, like, things to build in lane. I don't do it often, because, you know, in ranked, it's not the best. 24 is the best. But 
for fun, bro, that's one of the most fun things to do. It's why I like also like Ravenous Hydra. I take all that damage, but I can just heal it up. So like it just doesn't even matter. Like look at this, it does not matter. Plus 30, plus 30. Another reason why I like to go coal a ton, because of the free life steal. Nice. Hit a Q. He's like two thirds. Yeah, yeah, easy. He, yeah, he knows. He knows we're about to die. Okay, it's fine. Uh, we'll take tower. <laughs> we'll take the tower out. What is this Akali doing? Well, she's dead. Oh no! I'm a limit test. Oh, good laser. I'm dead. I got hit. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. I just wanted to limit test that. I mean, I had 3k gold. I probably should have backed. Okay, now I'm gonna do what's very annoying. I'm gonna build armor now. I'm gonna build Iceborne. I have just enough for it. Two items, 15 minutes. I got Iceborne, so hopefully they don't kill me now. Come here, Akali. Oh, they should be dead. That was a good ult. Oh, Soraka clutch. Nice. Soraka saved me. Dang, I'm 9 KP. That's rare for top laner to have most KP. Okay, we'll just push this. Honestly, bro, I would not be surprised if they FF, but you know what? I did what I wanted to do with Bork, bro. Like, be able to snowball. Like, this is done already almost 800 damage. Let's just with the item alone, bro. It's actually crazy. Like, it doesn't count to, like the other stats you get, like the damage and the lifesteal attack speed. Like, the item actually gives a ton of value on Nar. You saw the team fight was kind of closer than it should have been. Trinity Force would have dominated that team fight, but. Yeah. I probably should just get out, though. Dang, bro, I'm getting all their sun spells. Well, I mean, it's not horrible. <laughs> they have no flashes, right? Okay, we'll take it then. What is. It's fine. It's fine, it's fine. We should be able to get them. Right? Yeah, it's fine. We, got we get two for one there. That's not bad. If Caitlyn moves, we get two for one. Okay, good job, good job, good job. Okay, I'm gonna just build survivability, build Starax. Cause with Bork, you do get no HP, no resistance, so that's another reason why it's not the best. Especially for team fights. One on one, yeah, but team fights, not really. Not really the best. I'm gonna just TP. Remember, Sheen is also a Sheen item, or Iceborne's a Sheen item, so you can split. Not like, it's not the best, but it's like definitely very viable to split with it. The whole best. Bro, why? Okay, Bork is broken. Bork and Iceborne together are broken. What the heck? What was that? Okay, GG, the FF. What the heck? Yeah, yeah. Oh, I know what it was. I know why I was doing so much damage. I was doing so much damage because I had pressed the attack. I had Bork and Iceborne together. That's why I felt like I was doing so much. <laughs> okay, not bad. Most damage 20k and 22 minutes. Not bad. Uh, Pressy Attack, Iceborne, Blade Rue King, OP. And then yeah, here's my runes. I just went Snowball runes. It's pretty fun. And yeah, I went this build because I wanted to, uh, I, someone went board against me the other day and it destroyed me. So yeah, I just wanted to build it. Anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video and I love you guys forever and always. Bye-bye.